Welcome, I'm Christer from KG Interactive. In this tutorial I will show you how to get the color from a pixel on an object you raycast to. This can be used to create a color picker or an image map. I have created a project in 3D and included two images. The first one is the display image I want to use. And the second one is the image map where I masked out the parts of the image I want to be able to react to. You can leave the display image as it is, but the image map you need to enable read write and apply. So let's create a cube. And for this cube we need a material so we can place our texture on it. And we place our display image as albedo. And then we can place the material on the cube. Then we need to create a script. Let's call it image map and open it up in Visual Studio or Mono. And let's clean it up. We need four variables. The length of array. an array of our color values in the image map an array of the corresponding texts and our image map texture when we click on the texture we will print out the text that belongs to that color. So we need a method for finding the index of that color. And it will just loop through our colors and see if we can find that index. If we do, we return that index. Otherwise, let's return negative one. Sorry, this part should be I. Now we need to go into the update method. And here we need to do a ray cost. And we will only perform the ray cost if we press the left mouse button. And we will shoot from the mouse position. So we need to use the camera to create that ray for us. So 
if we do hit something, we will begin to figure out uh, at what texture coordinate we hit. But first, let's correct this little mistake. It should be colors. We need to retrieve the texture of the object that we hit. And for that, we need to find the mesh renderer. And then we need to need the texture coordinates. And we need to scale those with the size of the texture. We also need to know if the texture has been tiled or scaled. And then we retrieve the color. And then we try to retrieve the index from that color. So unless the index returned to us is minus one, then we didn't find uh, a color in our image map, otherwise we did. So let's just print out the corresponding value. So let's add this component to our cube. Let's add a ray distance, some colors, and in my image map, I have red, green, blue. Don't forget the alpha. And then let's add some text. The first one is Mr. Lech from Echo Tales. The second one is Ambrosia. And the third one is the logo of KJ Interactive. We also need to add the image map texture. And there's one thing we need to do uh, to get the texture coordinates. We can't use a box collider. So let's remove it. 
and let's add a mesh collider. That's the only way to get that coordinates. Just for the fun of it, let's tile our image. And let's try it out. So clicking here, we pressed uh, Ambrosia and Mr. Lech. And there we have the logo. Lech, Ambrosia, logo. So it works fine. Awesome. That's all for now. So check out Echo Tales, our development blog, and please subscribe. Thanks.